Mark. Marky Mark. Got to go. Mark. Okay, I'll give you a few more minutes to get up, okay? Ah. Uh, love you. Try to bring my belly down a bit big this weekend. So let's see how much the measurement is. Okay, I can't see it. So let's see. How to do it by my like 29 and a half so I'm gonna, gonna write this down waist I don't usually put this but since I'm tracking it this week I put west anyway Okay, so I'll be keeping track of that this week, 29 and a half. So today I am doing a new um, split. I'm going to be doing, I'm going to try to go a bit heavy this week. Um, today's Monday. Um, I'm using my cell phone, so let's see. Uh, not February, October 17th. So I will be doing... Um, upper body today I'm not sure if it's back or chest um I love to do back most likely I'm gonna do back this morning I'm gonna try to go a bit heavy and then um, I'll throw in some biceps and of course I try to abs I'm trying to bring the waist down so I'll be doing a little bit of abs so I'm not sure if I'm gonna record that much um, but We'll see how it goes. See you at the gym. Shut up and sit down. Bye-bye. <laughs> 
Shut up and sit down.
this glute machine i was so happy when i saw them have it it's a brand new machine they just put at the gym but it's so horrible you cannot adjust pad on my abdominal it doesn't go uh, higher and the leg uh, rest you can't um, really adjust it or turn it or anything like that um, i've used similar glute machine um, but this one uh, you know i cannot complain i'm glad they have it but i can't actually go heavy with this machine but because of my sciatic my back issue the pad for my abdominal needs to be a bit higher and it cannot go any higher than what it is so i cannot go heavy on it i'm glad they have it but it's really not the way i want to use it you can't really adjust many of the pad the way you know to fit your body your height your anything like that i was trying not to speak in this video um during the exercise but i just want to mention this i just came from the gym and i did back today today's monday actually what i got okay october 17th my phone i'm gonna end this and yes okay my result actually i didn't put that i was there for two hours let's see two hours whether or not you can see it yeah two hours one minute and i burned 563 calories so this information i'm gonna put on the computer soon so today is why did i give it and memory enter value yep 10 17 2016 okay i need to get this uh, I just came from the gym and I was not expecting to record as much as I did today. I almost record my entire workout. And uh, the only two I did not the only yes, the only two I did not do is the lat pull down and I have a version of it that I did earlier this month. I might tag it just for the picture of it. That's the only thing I did not record today. Other than that, I record everything that I did. I did uh, biceps, triceps, back, uh, shoulder presses. Uh, what else did I did? Uh, biceps and tricep with the cable and also with uh, dumbbells uh upright rolls and i did a bicep with uh, a barbell what else did i do pretty much everything that i did today i record one set of everything uh so i had a very good workout for about two hours as you can see i showed earlier i burnt about 560 something calories so now Where's my cookies? I didn't eat all. I made sure I didn't eat all because uh, my stomach is a bit big. I realized, although my oatmeal cookies are very good for energy at the gym only, for energy, but it's not good for the abdominal. And I realized uh, when, after I work out, if I eat more than two, my stomach, as you can see in this one, my stomach is a little bit I want to get rid of that part so um, this morning I sort of measure myself it's on my phone where is my phone I think it's on the desk so uh, I measure my waist so I'm gonna keep track of it this week and hopefully either I'm not gonna post everything on, on uh, YouTube or something like that but probably on my Instagram it's much easier for me to post and I probably will keep track of, you know, post a couple things on uh, Instagram. But uh, other than that, uh, I should, you know, get this going pretty good. So my back, I did back today. You know, in the kitchen. And apparently, 
the last workout that I did uh, and I posted, I believe it's uh, earlier this month, the 21st, I actually wore the same clothes that I'm wearing today. And I was thinking about it when I was working out. So I was like, oh, damn it. I wore the same clothes that I wore for back on the 21st. I believe it's the 21st, the date was. And that video is already up. So now, let me stop talking. Uh, this is the same thing that I've been having for a while. It's, uh, I'm going to have egg white as post-workout. I ate two oatmeal cookies earlier today. Two oatmeal cookies earlier today. I ate two oatmeal earlier. Okay, I still want you guys to see this. My face and that. Um, I ate two oatmeal cookies right after I work out. And uh, I'm kind of hungry. I could eat more. But because of my abdominal, and I don't need that much of uh, cookies. So I only ate two, enough to get me, you know, replenish my muscles and stuff like that. Um, and I knew I wanted to come and eat this. These were already pretty much prepared. All I have to do is warm it up. And only the egg white I have to make. So that's what I'm having right now. And I'm gonna, you know what? I don't need to dirty this. This is almost done, so I'm gonna warm it up in this. That's uh, cabbage. If you guys ever never have that, I think you, you guys should try it. It's cabbage, you stir fry it, and that's it. It goes with almost anything. All right, this, I don't want that. That's potato and chicken. I probably will have that for dinner later. And over the weekend, I stop at the supermarket to get another cabbage because I knew this is almost done. So I'm going to stir fry this. I think when I made that, I recorded it. I don't know if I put it up already. I have so many crap to upload and edit. And uh, my kids are in school, my oldest especially, is in school. And... Uh, every week or so he has tests so i have to help him study he's in second grade the first test he took he had a 67. Uh, why i did not there was a issue with that oh yes the issue was they did not uh some of there wasn't a lot of questions and some of the questions were not counted for but and uh the way they calculated, it ended up that he, uh, you know, had 67 or whatever. But I think overall, he only had, I think, three wrong out of the questions. So that sort of bring his grade, his, you know, test score down. So ever since then, I've been, you know, I'm putting this in the microwave. One, ten, zero, start. Uh, leftover coffee. So ever since then, his grade has been improving. For his math test, he had 100. A uh, couple of science, I think he had either 97 or 92. There was another test he had, it's either 97 or 92. So um, tomorrow, he's gonna have another test. Uh, and his teacher sent home the, the textbook for him to study. I'm a little bit upset the way the teacher sort of did it she sent the study guide last night she emailed it to parents last night last night was Sunday even though everything that she sort of put I uh, pretty much guessed for him to study for my son to study but I was a little bit upset what if I did not know that she sent it last night when I have all weekend, I could have studied with him. So, you know, that's the only issue I had. I'm not going to make a big deal out of it because I did study that those particular things with my son. But it's just the fact that she sent it last night, Sunday night at 7.30. I'm like, I didn't even bother, uh, you know, 
tell, tell my son let's study them because it's 7 30 and he needs a rest so today i'm gonna pick him up from school usually he takes the school bus so i'm gonna pick him up put two minutes for my coffee i'm gonna pick him up and then i'll st uh, study with him and he knows it so he's starting to get the routine he knows he has to study he needs to do well on his test so before he used to give me a hard time but uh if he wants to play video game he has to study he has to do well in tests in all of his tests so okay so there's my egg white uh wrap um my uh this is uh quinoa sticky rice and chia seed there's my, i'm gonna limit the amount that i put in there i don't want to eat too much because i'm watching that belly I don't even want to weigh anything. I used to weigh them when I'm really like in the summer. I guess I, I weigh my food to make sure um, uh, my diet is on point. But um, you know, as long as I don't eat too much. So and everything that I eat are healthy, and I like. It's not like it's diet for me to tell you the truth. I like everything that I make. I just wish that my kids will eat them. They don't even like my eggs, my oldest. He's like, he like his daddy's egg because daddy put all sort of stuff in the eggs. And mine, as you can see, is just plain eggs. I try to make them eat right. So anyway, that's my post workout. I, I don't need to put that much in there. I could eat that later on. So there it is, post workout. It's already 10 minutes, 11 minutes into it. There it is. So, uh, whole wheat wrap, quinoa, sticking wa sticky rice, and chia seed is in there. Uh, what is that? The uh, cabbage, egg white, and two of that. And that's my post workout. I'm lo uploading my uh, workout today. I recorded it. And this is my last. I made two of these uh, wraps. So this is my last one. Okay, I just put my information like I always do. Let's see if I could focus. Today's the 17th on Monday. I went in the morning. I did back, biceps, shoulders, glutes. Uh, 7 7, that's when I come up the stairs. I was there for two hours, one minute. And uh, 116 is for. Uh, average uh, HR and the next one is my highest was 157 and I burned 563 calories and my heart rate zone and um, was I was in my heart rate zone for one hour 25 minute and 58 seconds this is really good in terms of percentage I was there in 71 <clears> percent <throat> and I started my workout at 8 51 a.m. All right, I'm going to upload this. I'm using my phone. Actually, I just finished uploaded. This is my stuff. I'm going to try to work on them right now. And uh, this is the food I was just eating. I uh, put in the same thing. So I'm going to try to edit this right now. And one thing I've been trying... <laughs> After I did... I don't know if you guys saw my stick... This is the one that I drew on Instagram, and I did another one. Uh, I sort of did a video of how I did it. For It's not really logo, I guess, branding. So I've been thinking of making more, uh, doing bench press and probably some other things. So I might make another video about uh, the stickman doing bench press. I don't know. I'm having fun with that. But first, let me work on this.